When people ask about physics, I just get excited because it takes us on a journey because it constantly asks the question, well, what is that? Physical matter is energy in a state of definition. If you want to think about what energy is, energy is a motion or movement in a constant state of becoming. The whole entire world is energy, vibration, and frequency. So if you look at that from the perspective of light and sound, it's something that's a universal thing that anybody can tap into. That's the most exciting part is that anybody has the ability to tap into the quantum field. So when it comes to quantum physics, there's so much about our bodies that actually tap into the quantum world as well. Power that we all possess that comes from our soul, the I believe it's a connection to God, is enormous. That is one reason I do what I do today. So you have to be able to adopt a positive mindset in order to accomplish anything. You have to believe that you can do it. And you have to believe that you can do it in one lifetime using that energy, reprogramming, and eventually starting to free up that energy inside of our bodies so we can come back to being more of a clear channel. So as we witness frustration or anger, which is inevitable in our day-to-day -day lives, we can experience that and still not hold on to it and start to negatively impact our physical body. Being able to realize that energy is the key to like letting yourself fully repair was life-changing for me. Hand me a thought. You have thoughts, correct? Hand it to me. They can't. So there is emotions. We can't really see them even though we do experience emotions. For the healing side is to understand trauma. How do I understand trauma and what is the energy aspect of trauma? We destroy our own health with the wrong words because words come from an emotion and a thinking process. Once we understand what kind of energy words can have, magic will happen in your life. We don't need to heal our body because our body is healthy. The only thing we need to stop creating diseases, the moment the energy starts to flow in harmony with the universal intelligence. At that moment, there is no other choice for our body, just to create and to show the perfect health for our lives. According to my injury, there was no way in any world that doctors could understand that I would ever be able to use my arms again. And if I was very lucky, I might be able to use my fingers. So I was able to heal myself using energy. We don't need the whole world to be enlightened. That'd be fantastic if it happened. We need a significant percentage of the world. The people watching this, the people who are willing to do the meditations, the contemplations, to go into gratitude, to start acting from kindness, to listen to their inner guidance system, their own GPS. When all of that happens, they can bring a new level of awareness to the planet, a cleanse, if you will, and then a divine happening where what I'll call heaven on earth takes place.